Most people know that color is controlled by the output ICC profile, but output is only half the battle. Color is also controlled by your choice of an input ICC profile. Selecting the correct input profile can greatly enhance the color of an image. Once inside Wasatch, you can compare your input profile to your output profile using the Profile Viewer. Open the image you would like to print. Select the Color pull-down menu and choose the Profile Viewer. The Profile Viewer will give you a graphical display of the gamuts of the input profile versus the output profile. The input profile is represented by a cloud of colored dots. The output profile shows up as a gray hole. Where these two overlap is the area of color from the input that can be reproduced with the output profile. All color that lies outside the gray hole can be brought into gamut through the use of rendering intents. Rendering intents will be covered in the next training video. Switching the input profile to one that has a larger gamut will result in colors that are more saturated. To change the input profile, close the Profile Viewer. Select the Print pull-down menu and choose Print Setup from the list of options. Click Edit and then click on the Color Transforms button that is displayed in this window. The Color Transforms window displays a flowchart that shows how color is adjusted within Wasatch Soft Rip. To change the input profile to one that will support a larger color gamut, choose the Select button under the input profile that matches the color space of your image. This will allow you to choose an input profile from anywhere on your system. You can also choose from a variety of input profiles that are available from the Wasatch installation directory. Select your base installation folder and choose the input profiles folder. Select a profile that will help you achieve your desired printing objectives. For this training, we will choose to saturate our image with color by selecting the RGB input plus 30 saturation profile. If any changes are made to the input profile, Wasatch will prompt you to save those changes as a new imaging configuration. Continue to click OK to get back to the job screen. The job screen now reflects the saturated input profile that has been applied. This simple change has made the colors more vibrant and bright. Wasatch is already known for accurate reproduction of color. Combine that with the steps shown in this video and you'll be able to create colors that really pop and set you apart from your competitors. The color enhanced image is now ready to be printed. Select RIP and print.